Hi everyone, thanks for checking out another InfoSec Hub video. This is kind of the closing video when it comes to PFSense. Um, and I just want to show you what kind of packages are all available when we talk about PFSense. And I will highlight a few that um, yeah could be helpful here. There's a backup tool here uh, to uh, restore files, directories, um, free radius. Here with the uh, SQL, PostgreSQL, LDAP. Kubernetes. Uh, this is a load balancing option here. So you can have, if you have two internet connections, maybe at your office, you can install this load balancing uh, um, program. Uh, client proxy. So either an FTP or proxy server. Uh, this is also a load balancing a developer. Yes. IPERF, we know that for testing network throughput. Uh, we know that from uh, Linux. Uh, to, okay. Nmap, we know Nmap, and we will discuss Nmap in our upcoming uh, Kali Linux uh, tutorials. Uh, let's see. Network probe. Yeah, this is the PF blocker NG, next generation firewall, but uh, we already. The previous video we talked about the uh, PF blocker Devil uh, 3.1, uh, and this is an uh, older one. Uh, let's see if where is Squid Net Squid? Yes, this one. Yeah, now it's not really an issue anymore, but uh, you can you can make this into a proxy server, right? If this uh, because PF sense is sitting at the edge of your network, you can also make sure that if you're on a, you know, you have a data cap, you have a limited amount of data you can use on the internet. Uh, you can cache uh, web pages there, like frequently, uh, frequent loaded uh, pages. The clients can then connect to the uh, proxy server and fetch the pages from there instead of on the internet, which also all saves bandwidth. Sudo, think, WireGuard, VPN solution, proxy server but i also saw something of an ids yes this is the equivalent of snort a high performance network ids ips security monitoring engine uh shurikata shurikata i don't know what to say but uh, this is the alternatives of snort so where do you find this it's very easy it's here at system package manager and here you have an overview of available packages and this will also take a little bit of a while to show you what kind of packages are already installed here i hope it doesn't take too long it will be um, the firewall it will be snored it will be open vpn um, okay it takes too long this is easier it gets it off the internet and you can install it and you can add additional software packages on top of pfsense short video guys just to show you what's out there so proxy server um uh, ids ips um um here load balancing this could be interesting depending on where what your needs are if you really need reliable internet uh, and you need to be online all the time let's say for instance you do a lot of live streams and there's money and a lot of great audience involved and it's your living you have two ISPs, two uh, internet service providers. You can do some load balancing. If one goes down, PFSense can switch to the other one. So uh, neat stuff. Um, that's basically what I wanted to say. Thanks for watching our PFSense uh, series, the tutorial series. Um, and if you have any questions or any suggestions, please let me know. Uh, look forward to see you guys in our next series, which will all be about Kali Linux. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.